Tiffany and Mike should have given the guys and the girls their order, uh, which you're walking out. Um, from there, I will meet with everyone else, um, pastors, announcers, all of that individually, just so you know when and what you're doing. <laughs> yeah, I got it right here. So Sean, Jake, Brent, then Trot, and Kyle, Steve, Steve, and then Tyler is not here. Thank you. Got it? Got the placement? Any questions so far? Say about a week later, I was in the house and he was outside riding his bike. And uh, he came in and he said, "Dad, oh I mean, yeah." He goes, "I got to show you something." I go, "Okay." So I went outside with him and he walked me to my truck and he pointed out a scratch on my truck. He said, "Dad, you were right. <laughs> I should have run my bike in between the cars." <laughs> and uh, of course. I was disappointed that he disobeyed me and that happened, but, but I was also very proud of him for, uh, for telling me. I mean, at that age, to, to uh, confess something like that is pretty special. And uh, what I didn't realize at the time is that he gave me a glimpse of the man that he would become and, and that he is today. Um, a man of integrity, honesty, uh, courage, um, godly character and a man with a big heart and uh, your mom and I Michael are very very proud of you and um, we're very happy and excited that you met Tiffany um, Tiffany uh, shares many of the same qualities as you I mean she's she's kind-hearted she's compassionate um, she's um, when you're around her, she lifts your spirit. She's, got, she's that type of person. And um, she's got a smile that just lights up a room. And we're very, very happy. And we're, we're excited that, uh, that you're in the family down to We really are. And we welcome you with open arms. And tomorrow, you know, it's a big day. We're all praying for good weather. Um, we're praying that everything goes according to plan. Uh, but. We all know that God's will will be done when He brings you two together tonight. I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. No. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I have never seen her be more happy, so thank you. <laughs> um, she's a great cook, so you're, you're golden there, because I would have the best meals of my life when we were when we lived together. <laughs> um, but in, in you know, being serious, I'm just 
I can't like even put into words how excited we are for you guys to start your life together. And we're just we can't wait to be along in the journey with you. So. <laughs> um, there are couples here who have been married longer than uh, we've been alive. So I'm not going to pretend that we have all the answers, but um, I'll just share with you kind of where God has us now. And Mike, this is more for you. Um, study her. Study her. Study her. Communicate with her. Um, talk to her. Find out what she likes, what she doesn't. Just listen to her. Um, love her. And, and, and you, you, you've got a good... Uh, Tiffany, I met you by finding out that you were stalking me on Facebook for her. <laughs> that's, that's how I, I met Tiffany. Um, and Mike, you... <laughs> It's true, it's true. Um, Mike, I, I met you serving alongside you, and I've, I've never met a, a guy that was more uh, more apt to play the background and do whatever he had to and quiet and never wanted attention, never wanted the, the stage, just wanted to serve people and love them. Cheers. Hi. Cheers to Michael and Tiffany. Happy wedding day. It looks like it's moving south. I think we're on the edge, man. It's staying over here, Okay, now everyone give your, uh, give the other a kiss. That's a great 